In this video I will show you 4 top video editing tips and tricks that probably every video editor needs to know. Here are 4 top tips and tricks that you can edit the video by putting it in the biggest movie, cool music videos, vlogging videos, promo videos or other social media videos. Hello video editors my name is Sali Ali. Welcome to Sali Tutorials. Friends, I request you to please like this video. Because friends, the video is made with a lot of effort, I have to make it with my mind, so you must like the video. And if you find the video helpful, let me know in the comments. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe to the channel. So let's get started. To do this, you need to import at least two videos into the media. I import these two videos. Now I'm here to explain to you that you should have two videos whose first video is zoomed out. Like I have this video in which two people are sitting on the bike and this video was shot from a distance. And the second video should have the same character as the first video. We add video from this zoom angle so that our video is in full HD quality. And the quality result is not bad. It doesn't matter if you have zoom video in portrait format. You will understand this later. Now, first of all we have to drag and drop the zoom out video on the timeline which we have recorded from far angle. And then you have to drag and drop the video recorded from the zoom angle in the track above it. In step number 1, we have to split both videos every 3 seconds. To do this, move the playhead forward for 3 seconds. Select both videos and split them here. Move the playhead forward for another 3 seconds. Split both videos here too. Move the playhead forward for another 3 seconds. Split both videos here too. Finally split the extra length of the video. And delete the extra length of the video. Select all parts except the first part of the track below. Drag it forward equal to one part. This will create a gap between the first and the second part. Now in this gap. We have to drag and drop the first part of the video of the track above, and move it here. Similarly, create a gap between every other part of the track below, and drag and drop the part of the video from the track above to move it here. So this way you also need to adjust all the clips. Now you can see that our video looks something like this. But it did not end there. Now I will show you how you can make it a better edit. Now in step 2, we cut out the parts of the video recorded from the zoom angle. But learn how to cut it. It is very important for you to know this. Select a part of the zoom out video and click on the crop tool. From here the ratio should be 16, 9. After selecting the ratio, you have to adjust the position of the crop area. For example, I position the crop area here on both the couple's face and the shoulder area. OK. Select the next zoom video section and click on the crop tool. From here the ratio should be 16, 9. I place the crop area position here on the bike tires and their foot area. OK. Select the next zoom video section and click on the crop tool. From here the ratio should be 16, 9. I position the crop area here on the bike seat and their chest area. OK. I select the last part of the zoom video and click on the crop tool. From here the ratio should be 16, 9. 
After selecting the ratio, you have to adjust the position of the crop area. I place the crop area of this section on the face and shoulder area of both the couples. OK. The third step after doing this is the cinematic transitions. Go to transitions and click on it. Find the dissolve transition here. Apply this transition by dragging between the first two clips. Apply this transition by dragging between every other two clips. That is, leave these two clips after this transition. Similarly, apply this transition by dragging between every other two clips. After applying this transition, go to transitions again and find another transition here. The name of this transition is flash. Drag and drop this transition onto the middle clips, which we left out. Similarly, apply this transition by dragging between the other two clips. Next, step number four is the cinematic effect. To apply a cinematic effect, go to the effects tab and click on it. From here, drag and drop cinema 21, 9 effect into the track above the timeline. Keep the duration of the effect equal to the videos of the tracks below. Hopefully these four tips and tricks will help you make videos like this. If you have any questions regarding this video, please comment below. I will reply to your comment. And I will help you. I keep bringing you helpful videos like this. So please like this video. And if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Also visit my second YouTube channel Royal Sali. See you soon. Peace.